What's going on guys? It's a boy 3D print dude and today I'd like to give my honest review on the Polymaker PLA filament. I've been using this Polymaker filament to print tons and tons of stuff lately and I figured why not do an honest review. So like I said I've been using Polymaker PLA filament for a while now and I have to say it's quickly become one of my favorites. The quality and reliability of this filament are just fantastic. And yes, I just said fantastic. It's been a game changer for my 3D printing projects. First off, the print quality with Polymaker PLA is amazing. The parts come out super smooth and strong with very little need for pulse processing. The surface finish is almost glossy, which gives my prints a really professional look. Whether I'm working on detailed models or larger functional prints, the filament always delivers top-notch results. One thing I absolutely love about Polymaker PLA is how well it sticks to the print bed. The filament always adheres perfectly every single time for me. This has really helped cut down on issues like warping or prints coming loose loose, which used to be a headache with other filaments I've tried in the past. I recently printed a series of decorative vases using Polymaker's Vibrant Red PLA, and I couldn't be happier with how well they turned out. The color is rich and consistent throughout the spool, and the prints come out flawless. The filament extrudes smoothly with no clogs or inconsistencies. There was a little bit of stringing, but it was minimal and easy to clean up with a heat gun. What really stands out to me about Polymaker PLA is its durability. The prints are not just good looking, they're also strong and can withstand a fair amount of stress. I've printed several mechanical parts and prototypes with this filament, and they've held up really well under regular use. Another thing I appreciate is the consistency in filament diameter. With Polymaker, I never have to worry about uneven extrusion or print failures due to a diameter issue which is something I've had to deal with with other brands. Polymaker also comes off the spool really nicely, and it has some cool specialty PLA options that other brands don't offer, like their Polymax and Polylite lines, which are great for different types of projects. It's nice to have those options available when I try something new or need a specific type of filament for a project. On top of all that, their customer support is extraordinary. And yes, I said extraordinary. I've had a few questions about optimal print settings and I just sent it to them and they got back real quick. It's clear they really care about their customers and want to make them happy. But guys, I couldn't be happier with Polymaker PLA filament. If you want more info, you can consider using my affiliate link to go check out the website for more information. And I'll also throw in my other four favorite brands of filaments. Hit me up in the comments if you guys have any questions. I'm a normal dude and will reply. And please consider subscribing. The print has finally finished. And I gotta say, it looks pretty dang good. Let's take it off the plate here. All right. Man, this thing's cool, right guys? Look at this thing. Let's go test it out. This thing is beastly. All right, which sword do you want? Um, Big one or small one? Small. Small one? All right, let's battle. <laughs> oh no, it broke. We'll put it back together. <laughs> How did that break? 